The world is full of magic, energies, and so many possibilities. What if I told you, you can have anything you want? Yes, anything. Because with the universe, anything is possible. You are magic. Your thoughts are powerful. Your words are powerful. And what you believe is what you attract into your world. With the power of manifestation, you can create anything you want. Yes, anything you want. My shop, Jalissa's Manifestations, provides the tools to help you attract your desires, your wishes, your dreams. My candles are infused with crystals which hold energies and specific herbs to attract your manifestations. All you need is a wish and to believe. Energies are real and control your moods and what you attract. Sometimes we can feel depleted or in need of a boost of energy and that's what my spiritual baths are for. Cleansing, protecting, attracting love, abundance, and opportunities. The possibilities are endless. All you need is to believe. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dreams. Believe in the magic inside you. Just believe. Hello, my beautiful souls. It's your girl, Jalissa. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are good. I hope you guys are blessed. I am so happy to be here with you guys today. As you can see, my scenery is a bit different from the usual. I am not home, but I am definitely going to be doing the readings. All right, I'm here. I'm ready. And I hope you guys are too. All right, so this is for Virgo September love. And this could be for your sun, moon, or rising, and or Venus. Blessed. So this may or may not resonate with you. If so, definitely check out your other placements, babe. I will be posting all horoscope signs this week. Bless. All right, guys. So before we get into this juicy reading, I do want to give a quick PSA. PSA, PSA, PSA. Guys, be very, very careful with these scammers. There are scammers out here on YouTube and on Instagram. My Instagram is listed down below so you guys can know um, which is my Instagram, which is J-U-1-I-Z-Z-A. Bless. All right, guys, be careful. They're using my name, my logo, and um, my pictures, and they're pretending to be me offering readings. Right now, I am not doing any personal readings, so please do not get scammed. All right, beware, babe. I don't want you guys to get scammed out of your money. Bless. All right, guys, Um, if you do see the scammers, please report them if you can. Thank you so much. All right, before we get into this reading, I am going to give a quick thank you per the usual. All right, so I want to say thank you to you first and foremost for being here today for this reading. Bless. All right, I want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have liked, shared, commented, subscribed onto my channel. Thank you so much, baby, for being part of my family. Bless. I also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have donated to the channel any donations that come to the channel or that come to me for the channel go right back to the channel so i want you guys to know that bless um i also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have purchased any of my extended readings the after party all right where it gets real juicy and we get more details thank you guys for being part of my after party readings and being part of the extendeds i love you guys so much and because of you guys i'm able to be here on youtube doing what i love to do best which is spilling the tea hello <laughs> all right and i also want to say thank you to all those beautiful souls who have purchased anything out of my manifestation shop guys this month is a very special month as my shop has hit its first year all right my first year with my shop completed bless so i have my first year anniversary promo going on 25 percent off your entire purchase the promo is birthday all right so if you guys want to go ahead and grab something i'm giving away these um boxes limited time with the candles for my 
regular candles and my large candles. The mini candles don't come with a box, but each candle does come with an engraved lid, and they're so pretty. All right, guys, so if you want to take advantage, I have candles, crystals, mist, um, bundles, pyramids, all sorts of stuff there. Just go ahead and check it out. The link is down below. Promo birthday. Bless. All right, guys, and last but not least, Thank you, Spirit, Ancient Ancestors, Universe, Spiritual Guides, Angels, for being here with me today to channel this beautiful message for Virgo. Bless. Bless. All right, guys, let's get it. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's go. All right. Bless. All right, so let's do your angel number first. Spirit, Ancient Ancestors, Universe, Spiritual Guides, Angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Virgo. Thank you so much. Spirit, what is the angel number for Virgo? All right, Virgo, your angel number is 5653. I don't have anything to write on at this very moment, so I'm going to need you guys to write it down. 5653, okay? If you can, put it in the comments. I love you. Thank you so much. And share your message. Everybody gets different messages. 5653 is your angel number. Bless. All right, so let's get into this baby, all right? Let's get in... Let's start with the affirmation, and then we're going to get into your reading. What's happening in the month of August? Blah, 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 the month of September for Virgo. All right, so August could have been real... Um, I'm getting, like, real deep for you guys, because August is still coming up. So August could have been intense for you guys, Virgo. All right, let's talk about it. <laughs> let's go into september though we're going into the future so let's see what's to come spirit what is the affirmation for virgo affirmation for virgo today i love and treasure my body all right i love and treasure my body baby we need to own this energy is what spirit is saying i love and treasure my body no matter your shape size form whatever your body looks like it is yours and because it's yours you gotta love it like no other all right so spirit is really asking you to own that energy i love and treasure my body because i am beautiful and i'm perfect just as i am bless okay and we have i know myself and i honor my boundaries okay i know myself and i honor my boundaries bless all right so there's definitely some boundaries that need to be placed that needs to be honored. And I feel like you're in this energy, Virgo, where you're creating boundaries with friends, with lovers, and you're honoring that. And Spirit wants you to own that energy. Bless. All right, so let's get it. Let's go. Let's get into your reading. Wait, where's my music deck? Music deck. Oh, yeah. Guys, my music deck is in my shop. This is the box that it comes in, by the way. Um, And you can use the promo. Look, it comes wrapped up. This is a new deck. You can use the promo for um the deck if you like. 25% off. All right, baby, bless. Promo birthday. <laughs> I love my music deck. This is a fresh one. Yes, let's go, Virgo. All right, Spirit, Ancient Ancestors, Universe, Spiritual Guys, Angels. Please come through and help me channel this message here today for Virgo. Spirit, talk to me. What is the energy for Virgo in the month of September? September is going to be intense for everybody as we have portals opening up, retrogrades, all sorts of stuff. All right, Spirit, what is the energy for Virgo? Whoa, the month of September. September for Virgo, talk to me. What is the energy? Let's see. Virgo, month of September. And this chair is pretty low. I'm not used to being so low and close to the table, but it's cool. It's a new energy. <laughs> All right, we have J-Lo. Love don't cost a thing, okay? When you rolled up in the Escalade, saw that truck you gave to the valet. Knew that it was game when you looked at me. Pulling up your sleeve so I could see the roly bling. Saw you later in the corner booth. Raising up a toe so I could notice you. But your heart's a mess. Think you ought to know. Doesn't matter if you're balling out of control. All right. So there is some energy here revolving money. All right. So I do feel like someone is trying to um, 
do some kind of like stunting okay because <laughs> this is giving me some stunting energy love don't cost a thing this is i don't know if you saw the video with j-lo in this um song but she's like stripping herself of like jewelry clothes leaving the bends by the beach and just going to the beach and in the bikini and dancing looking good basically throwing the bag in the air i don't know if it was a prada bag whatever it was but it's kind of like babe you can't buy love and you can't buy me is the energy and love doesn't cost a thing so money shouldn't matter when it comes to love and that is an energy that's going to be present in the month of september for you guys we also have 50 cent 21 questions all right don't you trust me enough to tell me your dreams i'm staring at you trying to figure out how you got in them jeans if i was down would you say things to make me smile I treat you how you want to be treated. Just teach me how. If I was with some other chick and you so happened to see, and when you asked me about it, I said it wasn't me. Would you believe me or up and leave me? How deep is our bond if that's all it takes for you to be gone? We only human, girl. We make mistakes. To make it up, I do whatever it takes. I love you like a fat kid loves cake. You know my style. I'll say anything to make you smile. All right, so... This is the vibe, all right? So there is a lot of questions going around. I'm getting that you may be questioning the situation in the month of September with love. I'm getting someone is going to be asking you a lot of questions or they're going to be very um, like concerned and wanting to ask questions and a little curious about what's going on with you in your mind and where do you guys stand. And with this energy of... if. You saw me with someone else and you asked me and I said it wasn't me. Would you get up and leave? All right. So there is a little bit of a like playboy, playgirl type of energy with this love don't cost a thing and 50 cent um, 21 questions because it's kind of like I'm getting an energy of someone that stunts, someone that likes status or um, likes to show up and show out maybe likes to pretend to be somewhat of a player okay um but that is the energy that's coming through so let's get it let's go virgo let's see what's going on here in the month of september for you spirit ancient ancestors universe spiritual guys angels please come through help me channel this message here today for virgo what's happening for virgo in the month of september what does virgo need to know all right Spirit, ancient ancestors. We have the Ace of Wands coming out really quickly. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and channel this message here for Virgo. All right, so that's fire energy coming in strong. We have the Fool. Okay, so there is a new beginning in the month of September for you guys. Some sort of leap of faith here. King of Cups, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Ten of Wands. All right, so there is going to be a little stress. Clarify this Ace of Wands for me, Spirit. The Sun. Ooh, really nice energy. Clarify the Fool for me, Spirit. The Four of Wands. Okay, clarify this King of Cups for me, Spirit. Here we do energy. We don't do sex, FYI. So... Um, keep that in mind, all right? Flip the rolls if needed. Okay. We have the Empress. Wow, okay. Talk to me about this Ten of Wands. The Three of Wands. A little weight energy here. Back of the deck, the moon. Yeah, there. That, that 21 questions is right here with this moon energy. Where I feel like there is a lot of mystery in the month of September for you guys when it comes to love. Kind of like feeling like it's like your intuition is telling you something. Um, it's like you're, you're feeling something. You're, you're wanting to understand something deeper in the month of September when it comes to love. I am seeing a new beginning here for you guys, okay? So let's talk about it. Spirit, talk to me. September for Virgo. All right, we have gentleness. Ooh. 
We have positivity. And we have communication, all right? So there's definitely going to be communications in regards to the heart. All right, bless. All right, let me get some more energies out here for us. I have such a zen vibe with you guys. Are you guys like chill right now? Like there's such a beautiful energy here with you, Virgo. I'm feeling it. All right, talk to me, Spirit. September for Virgo. All right, we have free yourself. New love. We have let your friends help you. With heart-to-heart -heart conversations. All right, so I definitely feel like there is going to be a lot of communication in the month of September, babe. All right, let's see what else is going on for you guys. Yeah, there is new love, though. I'll tell you that much. If you guys are single, I'm definitely seeing some new love. Mm-hmm. September for Virgo. Mm-hmm. I do feel like there's a current... There's a current... Blah, blah, blah. There's a current energy that is present. Um, and I feel like you may be struggling with this, all right? There is, like, really, really deep emotions here. Um, mm -hmm. Someone may be acting over the top, extra, all right, right now with this past energy. But I am definitely getting some new energies, someone new coming in. All right, Spirit, talk to me. Virgo, September. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, all right. Um, Virgo, give me one second. I need to see if I can find my wand. Hold on one second. All right, Virgo, I couldn't find my wand, so I'm going to use... My crystal here. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through. Help me channel this message here today for Virgo. Thank you so much. All right, babe. Listen, there's a lot going on, all right? Because I'm getting new energies and I'm getting past energies. Okay, so I definitely feel like the month of September, your friends are going to be very helpful because I feel like, Virgo, you went through something recently. There is a lot of mysterious energies revolving you, meaning you're feeling kind of uneasy, uncensored, not balanced, all right? This is in regards to some sort of past energy. I feel like someone in your past um, or someone that's currently around is very suspect, all right, this is either past or current energies, but I am definitely getting someone that is very suspect, someone that is very shady. They have a lot, like, hidden, and it's like your intuition feels it. Like, your person is being kind of suspect, all right, untrustworthy energies. I'm getting that. I'm seeing you alone in the month of September. I'm seeing you doing a lot of, um, it's kind of like you're taking a break from everyone and you're spending a lot of time alone. You're trying to figure things out for self. There is a strong conversation that's going to come in between you and this shady person in the month of September. So this is either a past energy, like I said, or a current energy. I do feel like there is a lot going on via social media. This could be on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, wherever, Facebook. You know, there's a there's some, some sort of trolling energies. Like, I feel like this past person, this suspect person, this questionable person is doing a lot of things to intentionally piss you off. They're trying to get a reaction out of you. Um, is, is this argument petty energy that they have, all right? They want to argue with you. They want to debate something with you. They know they're being shady, and I feel like you may have questioned them or you're just questioning the situation. You're kind of side-eyeing this person, kind of like, mm, I don't know about you. There's something suspect about you. I can't see everything. I don't have the evidence to prove what I feel, but my intuition is telling me that you're suspect, all right? I do feel like... um. 
you may be feeling in the month of September really like over the top with your emotions. Um, I do feel like you're gonna try really, really hard to like cover up how you truly feel about a situation because it is gonna bother you. You're gonna struggle a little bit with this um situation with this person. It's gonna be really frustrating for a little while. It's not easy to deal with certain people, especially when emotions are involved and they're being shady and you feel it, but you don't have really a lot of um receipts or evidence to prove it so i just see you like frustrated with the situation it's not gonna be easy um it's a little bit of a setback and i just see you annoyed all right there's some sort of competition all right so this could be either um competition with your person i definitely see that there is going to be competition for your person this past person current person whoever they are there is going to be competition and i'm going to tell you about that in a second all right but i do feel like there could be some sort of competition when it comes to this person as well meaning third party interferences that's why we're getting um this energy of if you saw me with someone else and someone told you that they saw me with someone else or whatever would you believe it would you believe me or up and leave me how deep is our bond if that's all it takes for you to be gone all right so there is some sort of competition energy and um spirit is just basically letting you know baby it's time for you to let them go all right whether this is a permanent let go or a temporary let go, that's on you, free will, right? But there is definitely an energy around letting them go right now because they are depleting your energy is what spirit is showing me right now. Um, yeah, there is a need for you. There is a need for you guys to like sit down and clearly express how you guys feel about each other because i feel like there's a lot that hasn't been revealed i feel like you have been very very expressive very um more i feel like you've been more emotional and more grounded in this connection with this past or current person than they have i'm getting that they're like resistant all right resisting the connection resisting expressing themselves acting cold acting as if they're not looking at you or giving you their energy just i'm getting resistance like they're resisting being honest they're resisting giving you that energy that you want all right that heart-to-heart -heart conversation but there will be a conversation happening now this is what's gonna go down as you let them go just know that a whole door is going to open for you, Virgo. A whole door. Yeah, there's going to be this person that's coming into your world. This person is definitely going to put you in a very positive, beautiful energy. Now, um, what I'm seeing is like an instant connection, all right? Like you guys are going to definitely be attracted to this person physically, all right? So chemistry is going to be on point. <laughs> um, besides the chemistry being on point, which is very important and also good to know, I also see you really happy, all right? So this person that's coming in, something new all right this person could be a water sign cancer pisces scorpio but this is new energies i'm seeing you take a leap of faith i'm seeing you um blindly trying this new situation out because this other situation is like you're freeing yourself from it there's some sort of tie to it there's obviously deep feelings there's something emotionally rooted here but there's so much that hasn't been revealed and that's unsettling all right so i do feel like your soul your spirit is just not comfortable with this person because this person isn't being transparent with you this person is being cold they're resisting they're not really giving you what you're giving them there is an imbalance where you're doing more than them that and you guys are not meeting halfway you guys are not seeing eye to eye this new person that's coming in this new love they're gonna really stir up things for you especially romantically and i see your friends helping you out so you could either meet this person with your friends and they help you out with this or you're just gonna talk to your friends about it and they're gonna give you guidance with this new um love interest which is beautiful you could be meeting this new love interest while traveling as well is what i'm getting for some of you guys but i just see you really really happy really really happy taking a leap and this new connection that's coming in is something that's gonna bring in stability to your world so i do feel i do see you feeling more stable i do see you like shopping around feeling better in much more better energies no longer struggling no longer feeling frustrated all right so um 
this is beautiful and as you do this let me tell you this past current person whoever this person is that's in your energy they are going to lose their shit okay <laughs> they are gonna realize how empty their life is without you and this is really gonna bother them is really gonna bother them and they're gonna know that there is someone new I don't know how they're going to find out. Maybe you'll tell them when you guys have this conversation because there is a conversation coming in where you guys will be opening up to each other about your feelings. Um, either way, there's this new person. So I do see you really happy with this new person. I only see that you're going to be overwhelmed about things unfolding. All right. And this is just within self, your manifestations, work, you know, average life type of things. All right. So I just see you a little frustrated, wondering when things are going to unfold for you. But I do see you manifesting and I do see you very connected. This new person that's coming in is going to be very gentle with you. There is a lot of positive energy connected to this new energy, this new person. And this person is going to be very giving. Okay, so this person is going to want to give you a lot. They're going to want to show up and tell you how they feel. They're going to show up and let you know that they're very much interested in something with you. And what they're interested in is a relationship. All right, this person is truly going to be interested in starting something very beautiful with you that um is going to grow, all right? Cuz what they're looking for is to build a foundation and grow an empire. So you're going to feel the energy from this person where they're going to let you know like listen, I'm here. I know what I want. I really I'm really attracted to you. I like your energy. Um looking for something real and if you're willing to try, let's go. All right, cuz I do see like this beautiful 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 like powerful energy and this person is going to feel a lot of emotions in regards to you. Like they're going to be really feeling you emotionally and you're going to know it and you're going to feel it and this is going to help heighten your energy. This is going to help bring you in to this beautiful energy of like owning your body, owning yourself, having more confidence, feeling great about yourself to the point where you start doing new things and you start feeling yourself. And that's very beautiful because I feel like this past person, current person, whoever this person is that has been giving you this very frustrating energy, it has made you question self. Like, is it me? Is it is it the way I look? Is it what I'm doing? What What is it? Why is this person acting like this? And um, it's not you. It's them. They have some sort of issue that they have to deal with self. And it reflects onto you. Hurt people hurt people. You ever heard that? hurt people hurt people okay so this person is hurt they're going through their own karma their own cycles and unfortunately that reflected onto you where you may have started questioning yourself and becoming a little bit i wouldn't say insecure but just like questioning yourself like is it me all right because this person is obviously insecure about themselves where they feel like status money or um what they have um, resembles who they are as a person and uh, that's not even true right but that's when you know that someone is very insecure when they have to get the cars the house the jewelry the clothes to cover up all that insecurity not saying that that's what they do because it's going to be different for all of you but i do get that energy off of your person and um this past current person. So I just see you in the month of September freeing yourself, freeing yourself from this connection that has brought you down and meeting someone new that is going to uplift your energies and lift you up. And I just see you so happy about it. I see you looking good. I see you checking out, seeing what you're going to try on, what you're going to wear, um, what you're going to do, shopping for candles, possibly mine, <laughs> um, just shopping overall, just really feeling good. You know, when you're on the phone and you start walking around the house and you're like so into the conversation, like you start doing stupid things, like, I don't know, cleaning things that you don't even need to clean, but you're just doing it because you're on the phone and you're jonesing and you're just in the vibe and you're just happy and you're laughing and people could see it in your face. That's going to be the energy in September when you meet this new person. And they're definitely going to be gentle with you, which is beautiful. And I love it. It's lots of positive energies coming in for you guys in September. This is definitely a flip. All right. We're flipping the script. Bless. All right, guys. So let's go into um, 
messages because I don't have charmies. I know. Don't don't be me up. All right. <laughs> like I said, I am traveling. But that's how you know how dedicated I am to my family. Even when I travel, I am doing my readings. I am not going to stop doing what I do because I'm not home and all that good stuff. Um, My son doesn't like it. <laughs> he complains. Mom. But, you know, I make time. I give everybody a piece of me. I give everybody a piece of my time. All right, guys. So let's get some messages. I'm going to get some messages from your past person. And we'll go into that, and then um, I'm going to do an extended. If you guys want to join me, you're more than welcome to. So the extended is going to be listed down below in the description. I'm going to play Love Don't Cost a Thing as um, I shuffle and lay the cards out. And I'm just going to go deeper into September and what's coming in, this new energy, this past energy, whatever spirit wants to talk to you about. Okay? So let's get some messages. Let's see what it is that your past person wants to say to you okay and bless all right i gotta shuffle like this deck is so big i gotta break it in four spirit chances is universe spiritual guys angels please come through and help me channel this message for virgo what does virgo's past person current person want to say to them at this time What does Virgo's past person, current person want to say to them at this time? Oh yeah, I'm also gonna post. Um, I'm also gonna pull some advice for you guys, Virgo. So what I'll do is, um, I'll do the reading. I'll get some messages for you guys and some advice in the extended. All right, babe, bless spirit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guys, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Virgo. Spirit. What does Virgo's person want to say today to Virgo? Virgo's past, current person. What do they want to say today to Virgo? And I opened up my eyes today. From the sun shining on my face. And it became so clear to me. The happiness was on the way. Fuck everyone, it's me and you only. All right, so they have like a very aggressive energy where they're just like, F everyone. Like, it's me and you only. All right, and this is like kind of like whether there's interferences or whatever, they're like, F that. Like, it's me and you only. Hello? I want to live with you. Okay? Like, I don't care about that person. I don't care about this person. I only care about you. All right, so that's what they're saying. They want to live with you. All right, that's pretty deep. I want to travel with you, all right? So they want to live with you. They want to travel with you. Give me a few months, all right? They feel like they're not ready right now. They need a few months to get it together. I want a family with you. Yeah, there's a lot of I want, I want. I want a family with you. I want to live with you. I want to travel with you. I just need a few months to get my life together. My heart is breaking, all right? There is going to be this very competitive energy coming in with them when they realize that you have someone new, just FYI, they are very, they're going to become very competitive and they're not going to want to um, like kind of cut you loose. I want to speak my truth to you. Yeah, they're going to speak their truth to you when this happens, when this all comes in because there is a conversation. I don't care about my ex. All right. So there could have been a conversation about an ex and um, whether or not they still have feelings for this ex. And they're just like, I don't care. Um, you deserve so much better. They know that they haven't been enough, whoever this person is. They know they haven't been enough. They haven't done enough. And that you deserve so much better. Back of the deck, I see us growing old together. All right, so they have a lot of energy revolving the future with you. But as of right now, they're telling you that they're hurt right now. Their heart is breaking. They're not in a very comfortable energy. Um... They don't want you concerned about other people and they want to speak their truth to you. But they need a few months to get it together is what they're letting you know. And they do feel like you deserve someone way better than them. So they at least acknowledge that, that they haven't been enough for you and they haven't done enough for you. All right, baby. Bless. All right, guys. Well, unfortunately, I don't have my charmies. <laughs> so I cancel my charms, which is my favorite time of the day. Because I was traveling, I was only limited a certain amount of weight, traveling, blah, blah, blah. So my cards are very heavy, 
FYI, believe it or not. Um, they are. So I couldn't travel with my charmies. I had to like let the charmies stay back home. But I am gonna do an extended, guys, if you're interested. And I'm gonna play Love Don't Cause a Thing as I shuffle and lay the cards out. I'm gonna see what else Spirit wants you to know about September. And um, if I pull anything about your person, I'll let them I'll let you know about that. And we're gonna pull messages. I'm going to pull whoever's energy is strongest in the extended, whether it's a new person or the past person. I'll pull their messages and we'll get some advice and guidance from the universe. So if you want to join me, bless is going to be a party. <laughs> We're going to get a lot of juicy details. You can. The link is down below in the description and I hope to see you there, babe. All right. Um, bless. If so, give me a minute. I will be right there. Thank you so much. Virgo, if this is where we are parting ways, I just want to say I love you. Thank you so much for being here. Happy birthday in advance or happy birthday in general. I hope you guys party up and do it up this month. And um, get yourself a birthday candle, all right? It's a uh, love, abundance, and road opener candle all in one. And you could use my promo birthday, all right? 25% off bless and i'm wishing you guys nothing but the best if you enjoyed today's reading please give it a thumbs up as it helps the channel and i love you guys that's what family does if you guys are new to the family welcome listen this is a beautiful community if you want join 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 for sure check the comments you'll see and also i want you guys to know i am baby oprah every week i am doing raffles and I give away a lot of stuff. In my packages for the weekly raffles, I give away candles, crystals, decks, all sorts of things. This week, I'm giving away a candle, a amethyst cluster, and a third surprise gift. So in order to be in it to win it, you have to subscribe and hit that bell button, babe. So welcome to the family. I hope you guys enjoyed today's reading. Um, my OGs, you already know what time it is. I love you guys so much. I'm sending you love, light, and everything nice. Mwah! Deuces! And I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs> Bye. Love you. Bless.